Curator is the modern bookmark manager, a tool that's going to save you hours every week just looking for information. It's also a publishing tool that lets you publish your curated content from your browser directly to your website and newsletter, including YouTube videos that will automatically embed on your site. Let's take a look and see how it works. What makes Curator different is that it scrapes vital information off of the screen and allows you to modify the headline, choose where you want to save the content. If you want to add new folders, you can do it directly from the pop-up, scan for images, modify the description, put in the publisher, author, and content tags. You can either use what you already have in the folder or create new ones and save it. Curator works seamlessly with chat GPT inspired tools like Glass, which is a social highlighter that allows you to highlight different areas of the content like I have done here. Activate Glass and then use the chat GPT extension to quickly summarize the content. Once you summarize it, you can simply copy it and you notice that Curator has now changed color, which indicates that the, this post has already been saved. Now I just have to simply highlight and copy and then edit the content that I have just copied into Curator. I can add formatting by creating paragraphs so that makes it easier for me to later read it and also when I share it, users can easily read what the summary of the content. Curator has powerful integrations with third-party platforms. We integrate with Feedly, a news reader that allows you to monitor your newsletters and different publications all in one place and easily add your favorite post to Curator by clicking on the read later. We also have an integration with YouTube where you can add any YouTube video to your Curator app by simply liking it and then generate transcripts using chat GPT inspired tools like Merlin, which is one of my favorites. And from here, copy the transcripts and paste it into your Curator description. You can obviously edit the content in here and save it along with the video, which is really powerful when you publish and share it or even for your own reference. We have an integration with Pocket, one with Reddit. And what this means is you have now access to Curator from any app. You could be reading news and information on your phone, on your iPad, on TV and automatically adding your favorites to your Curator app. Curator is your browsing companion that promises to save you hours looking for information. I pin my Curator tab to my browser so it's always easily accessible to me. You can easily search for your content using your tags. Curator lets you search for your content, author, and publisher tags locally. You can also filter information directly from the cards by clicking on the content tags or the publisher tags. I can share my folders with my colleagues for collaboration. If I share it, the color is blue. If they share it, the color is orange. I can also search my information globally and by tag publisher author description so if i search for content curation for example you can see i get a list and i can quickly see where the content is and by selecting it i can also read the summaries so it reminds me what that content is all about Curator offers powerful methods for publishing your content to your website and newsletter. If you have a WordPress website, 
you can use the kbucket files section where you create a file with multiple folders attached and publish the entire collection to your website or you can add individual folders to the sync folder and then publish the content using an rss feed if you have a newsletter this is a great way to publish content to your newsletter or using card and youtube embed files for youtube embed it only needs to be youtube videos card can have a mix of content and you have the option to select multiple themes whether card plus text or image only and we will have more themes in here you can see we have card and carousel this is the entire library and this is a carousel library next we will take a look and see how these look on your website here are some examples of the sync folder publishing directly from the folder this is a carousel image only carousel as you can see and when users click on the image you can see that it's going to play the video directly on the page and the transcripts is published along with the video on your website here is another format card plus text you can see when it's youtube video it says watch now whereas when it's a card embed it's going to say read more and here when you click on it you can now see the comments and when you click through it's going to take you to the website when you publish the entire gallery users have the option now to select content tags or sort the information the same way they do it inside of curator or do it straight from the card and filter information and view it in context here are examples of the wordpress publishing you have more options with wordpress we have a slider module widgets that embed using short codes anywhere on your website here is an image only gallery with wordpress you can publish mixed of content so this is a video when i click on it you can see that it's going to play the video with the transcripts and this image is a link to an article so it's just going to open up the article with the comments and people can click through to the content you can see this is a card plus text and a carousel widget down below you can also publish the entire content to a dedicated hub where users have the option to view different channels on the same page and when you share content from your curated hub on your social channels it will drive traffic back to your own website a great way for content marketers to use third-party content to generate inbound traffic